Morning, everybody. Uh, who's, uh, who's starting in goal for you tonight? Uh, Shusty. Well, That's the only thing I got. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what have just kind of your reports from Hartford been on, on Brandon's game with him? If he comes in tonight, what are you looking to see for him? Uh, he's played really well for them, steady defenseman. Um, you know, he's big, strong. Um, so if that does happen, we're excited to get him in and see him play. With, uh, with your forward rotation and your, you know, your conversations with uh, Cooley, um, how do we handle you know not being in the lineup? Well, there are conversations with multiple people, right. you know. So it's not uh, like I said, it's not about Will. He, uh, you know, he was not in last game, but uh, he'll be back in tonight. So their their conversations. Are, listen, I, I said the other day, I'd love to play thirteen forwards. Nobody deserves to come out, but that's where we're at. Well, we're working through a couple things in the room, but Will's going to play. Oh, yeah. What have you? Um, the record's been really good of late, obviously, in that President's Trophy race. What have you thought of the the standard that you wanted from the start of the season to where it is now? Just the process that you've had this this season in general yeah. to, to get where you're at. I mean, there's always things that you're working on. I've said that earlier in the year. There's some things that are going well, some things tail off and you work to get the things that are tailing off back up here and then something that you're not even thinking about goes sideways and you got to get that one back in check and um, for the most part it's I think we've done a pretty good job of playing a game there was a you know small glitch for about 10 games in the middle of the season where I thought maybe we could have played better um, but right now I like the way that we're playing um, we seem to be pretty good defensively with our game we're competing hard we're skating well and, um, you know, I think that the results lately have been a reflection of the way we're playing the game. I even like the, you know, I mentioned I, I hated the result against Winnipeg, but I didn't mind the game. I thought we played a, a game where we doubled up in a lot of areas and just the scoreboard didn't, didn't go our way that night. And so you go back to work and try to change the scoreboard as well. So I think it's been a, I think, I think our guys are in a position right now where they're playing pretty well and we're getting the results from it. That being said, we're constantly working on things and inside the room, even from last game, on things that we can do better. With, uh, I know you, you've liked... You said one question. <laughs> <laughs> I keep thinking of more. I know you've liked what you've seen from, from Zach Jones, but you know, um, presuming he has to move up a little bit in, in the lineup a little bit tonight, um, are you interested, excited to see what he can do with more responsibility? I think he's going to, I mean, he's, he's playing really well in the minutes that we're giving him. I think to add to those minutes, I don't think that changes anything. There's lots of times when he's out there against other teams' top players. There'll be, you know, there'll be times tonight when he's out there against Philadelphia's top line. And what he's really proven in the last long stretch of games for himself here is that he, he can compete and play those minutes hard and play them well. He's done, a, he's done an excellent job. Out of the box, obviously, we know the player he is. His production is good. It's been better. Yep. His overall game, just I mean, in the last 10 games. Is, what, for me, it's right on point. I've mentioned it to him a few times. Like the way, the way his authority out on the ice and the way that he attacks the game. And, you know, all, when you're talking about those top defensemen in the league, they all do it a little bit differently. Um, but you can see right now that he's on point. Um, with his, his skating, his puck decisions, his puck movement, his shot, his attacking the game. There's, um, there's been a, a real, for me, there's been a real uptick in the last, you know, 15, 20 games of the way he's playing. Um, I, it's, it's visible when you watch him play. Was, was, did you think he was off before that 15 to 20 minutes? No, I think there's, no, not necessarily. I don't think he was playing poorly. Um, but like any... Like anything, any person in sports, there's there's always I think elevation to their game. It's not you don't have to be off to elevate even more. Um, he's had a he's had a strong year for us, a good year. I think, you know, there was a time when he was out with that injury where he was coming back and he was kind of working his way back. I think that that plays into the athletes sometimes when you're coming back from a a tough injury, and so I think he worked through that. I don't think his game was bad at that point. 
but as maybe it's just later in the season, it's starting to close in on the playoffs and down the stretch here. And for me, his game is elevated. You've had a couple of close games against the Flyers this year. What is it about what Philly does that presents a challenge? They're hard working. You know, they're we're 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 expecting one tonight. You know, they're fighting for points right now. They're fighting for that spot. And um, the games that we've had have been competitive. And I. I watch, you know, a little bit of it when it when we're not playing them, but uh, their success, they they they've got some good players. They're young, they're fast, and they compete. Man, if you have that, anybody can beat anybody, and so they've done a good job of playing a consistent brand of hockey. They've done that when we played them. Um, they've been good games.